Good evening. Once again, we've got gray skies here across the Carolinas. We've already seen one batch of steady, if not heavy rain push on by. That's going to continue to work its way on out. We managed to touch 60 this afternoon. Tomorrow, the next few days, we're going to do a lot better than that. But there will be a price to pay. We got the scattered showers rolling east this evening. We're going to see a bit of a lull before batch number two arrives later on tonight. As far as this evening goes, just a couple showers around. Temperatures remain about steady, generally in the upper 50s, before temperatures uh, again start to fall a little bit toward morning. There's that next batch of showers and storms beginning to develop the initial wave moving through, but in what we call the warm sector where the air is warm and moist thunder showers beginning to develop now Kentucky and Tennessee, and that's what will sweep through late tonight while we sleep. Here's the very latest future cast evening showers kick on out. We'll see the lull, but by 10 11 o'clock more moderate to heavy rain will be upon us. There could be the rumble of thunder in this. There could be some gusty winds as well. The greatest risk for that will be south of the North South Carolina border. So in the Midlands of South Carolina, York, Chester, Lancaster, Chesterfield counties. It is swing out by about two, three o'clock in the morning and then just some leftover clouds first thing on Wednesday. Again, we're going to see the, those showers work their way on to the east as we go through the uh, night. And again, heavy rain will be the greatest threat from this, uh, as well as maybe some gusty winds. And that's probably going to be the worst of it as we go through the overnight hours. Uh, severe weather risk again looks low, not zero, but it is pretty low. By morning, we're talking about lower to mid 50s and most of the immediate metro 40s out toward the high country. For those still commuting, we're talking about temperatures rising into the low 50s by 9 a.m. Just some leftover clouds. And finally, some nice weather Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. No weather concerns at all. In fact, we'll do nothing but get better as we warm things up. Leftover clouds disappear by around lunchtime. There may be a sprinkle in the mountains. That'll be about it a Wednesday morning. But as the winds turn into the north and eventually northwest, we dry things out, get rid of the clouds and start to build that warmth. Walking in at the greenways with the kids tomorrow, we're pushing 70 as we go through the afternoon. Gastonia, same story, winding up in the upper 60s to near 70 degrees. And that trend or warming trend will continue in the high country. Leftover showers first thing, then we'll see mid to upper 50s in the afternoon. Done with the rain for quite some time. In fact, pretty deep into next week before we see another rain chance. But how about this warmth? Middle 80s on Saturday, low 80s on Sunday. We'll have a chance to get out. Just be safe and be well.